Hi everyone, Carolina is here. Today we came to this lovely antiques and vintage shop here in Menton in the south of France. It's my second visit in this shop. I will leave the link of the first video that we uh, filmed last year in the description box and also at the end of the video so you can check it out. Let's go and see. Let's go. That's a lovely shop. They do have this open garden, which is also decorated as a garden, only that you can buy the items that you see in here, which is very cool, I think. Oh, look at this lemon. That's huge. Oh, and by the way, if you didn't know, Nanto, so the city in which the shop is located, is known as the capital of Lemon, of France. So you will see Lemon everywhere, basically. Let's see if we can find some items that we already see. Oh, this one I do remember. I checked this one last year. That's so funny. And it's still 12 euros. I didn't buy it because it was damaged, as you can see. But that's a cool little vase. The glazing is really lovely. I do remember that they had a bunch of plates. Here they are. Look. Let me give you a better. A better look at all this lovely display that they have in here beautiful right let's let's check some of them that's a cute mental milk pitcher a massive one, so it's Menton by Saragami. 45 euros this one. That's about the right price for it. The lighting is not that great, so I'm sorry if you cannot see in detail, but it's the best I can do. Still, you should, you should be able to see it. I do remember these plates from last year, so they are 12 euros a piece are those mushrooms no because there is a bird so are those flowers it's hard to tell i thought those were mushrooms so it's terre de fer hb and c okay else do we have in here? Look. You can see lemons everywhere. Just as I said. Ah, 
I don't know what I'm looking for. <laughs> Definitely smaller pieces that could fit in my hand luggage. This vase is nice. It's only 12 euros. It's hand painted, but it's pretty heavy. So, not something I would buy this time. I think I'm more looking for smaller pieces of art or some home decor uh, items. But again, on a smaller side. That's pretty. It's 38 euros. Ceramic piece inspired by all this Art Nouveau style. Really lovely. I really like this Mary Poppins cardboard piece. Some fingers are missing. <laughs> and there's no price. But I think she's precious. I like Mary Poppins. Really cute. And very light too. Perfect. Very cute. They do have some vintage costume jewelry as well. I really like this brooch. Well, at least I think that's a brooch. And it's only 6 euros. I will check this one out later. A cute hand painted Russian drinking box. This one is 45 euros. I recently bought a much smaller than this for 1 euro that I sold for 50. But if you are buying for yourself, that's a not bad deal. It's also signed by the artist here. I do remember this room, it's full of treasure, all the shop is full of treasure. Oh, that's new, look at this thing, it's huge, I love it. I couldn't fit this gorgeous lady in my apartment, but I really like her. She's so precious. And she's not for sale. Hello ladies. And we see our friend Spider-Man is still here. Hanging on. That's a super cute giraffe piece. It's 75 euros. I believe it's ceramic. It should be. I've never seen a giraffe before. I quite like it.
Let's check some art, shall we? I like all the lithographs very much, but I'm not that much into the boats, so it's not something I'm looking for. I prefer portraits. So let's keep looking. Here, treasures are pretty much everywhere, so let's not forget to check the shelves, like this one, look, that's a cheap piece, it's only 12 euros, it's a lithograph, cute, let's see what they, what else do they have here? Yeah, they are all more or less the same. That's interesting, but that's something I already bought last year, so let's keep looking. That's a pretty good deal for this Nigel candlestick holder set for 110 euros but the condition is not great I don't know if I would be able to fix it and also it's massive <laughs> it's something I would like to buy in the future but maybe next time lovely piece though I also spotted a piece of pottery. Let's let's check this one out. Thirty-five. That's a planter or a vase. I don't know, but I quite like it. Right? That's a nice one. Now that's a different angle. <laughs> that's a pretty neat Vortelli style bench. It's only 95 euros. I like the fixtures. I really like this piece, this poignet de port. I don't know, don't remember how you say it in English. I will pop the the English translation on the screen. So it's 85 euros. Gorgeous ceramic piece. The ceramic and metal piece. That's a lovely drawing, is it? Very cute. That's cute. That was just a print. Oh, not just, but that's a print. 
She's very cute. Treasures are everywhere, but really, really, literally everywhere. Check out this yet another room. Let's see what we can find in here. Cool sign, but not for sale. Oh, I need to check this pile of comic strips. I used to read Mickey Mouse comic strips when I was a child. I really like them. Our ones were slightly different and not as old as these ones. They are cool. I all I always liked Donald Duck for some reason. How much are they? Oh, it's three euros a piece. That's not a bad price. I'll check that pile later on. Look at those massive toothbrushes. Well, that's my hand for comparison. <laughs> Oh, that's for sure not a toothbrush or maybe that's a horse toothbrush <laughs> I don't know in any case I don't know but in any case it's really cool any cool tin boxes in here that's a very unusual shape, is it? It's 35 euros to... Oh, it's not a box. What is it? Is it a box? Was it a box? I don't know. That's cool. As you can see, I forgot my gloves, <laughs> my 15 gloves. Oh well, and I brought them with me on purpose and I forgot them at the hotel. Well, that's okay, never mind. That's a super cool signboard for Le Petit Journal. You remember we seen this old magazine, daily magazine, 
daily journal, I should say, right? A daily newspaper uh, at the flea market, at the antiques market in Paris. And this is a signboard to advertise it. So it says, Le Petit Journal, tous les jours, every day, five millions. That's cool. And it's not expensive. It's, it's only... Oh, it is expensive. Okay. I thought it was 38 euros, but that's just the number of the item. It's 160 euros. That's about right. I don't know what's going on with the Spider-Man team, but he's basically everywhere. Probably they just like him. There is fish. I didn't know that. I didn't see them last year. That's so cute. No. Mm. I'm sorry I don't have any bread. I always love golden fish and corn. They have quite a bit of furniture as well. In case you are traveling with a truck. <laughs> oh wow, that's a new thing for me. I've never been to this room. That's awesome. Look at this. Wow. That's so cool. I didn't know this room existed. Wow. I'm always pleased to discover something new. That's a part of the excitement. That's a cool hotel sign in here. Very nice. I also love old head boxes. Old head boxes, but they are usually very expensive. Like this one, it's 120 euros. That's a naughty painting in there. Watch, what a gorgeous box. That's a paper box. No, it's not paper. 40 euros. How old is it? The price in franc, so it got some age. But is it that old? I don't know. I like it regardless. Very cool box. Slightly terrifying horse.
I like those biscuits. Le petit beurre. I need to walk carefully because stuff is everywhere, also on the floor, so it's important to have a good look before putting my foot on the floor. If you fancy some champagne, here you go. I really like old signboards. I think they are very cool, but they definitely look better on a bigger wall, like in a loft apartment. Not the tiny one I'm currently living in. Hello, guys. I like that sun or shoe repair. Is that the singing fish? Hello. No. This one doesn't want to sing. Okay. Let's leave it here. Look at this massive pile of shoes. That's impressive, isn't it? How do you pick a pair? I don't know. I see lots and lots of art in here. Do they have some smaller pieces than this massive thing? Ooh. Let's see. I'm trying not to fall. Here. Here, where we are now. Okay. Let's take a look. Let's take a quick look, because that's what I'm interested in, the art pieces. I'll check those out, because it's pretty dark in here. If I find something cute, I will show it to you later, okay? Let's do this. Okay, so I didn't find anything in those card boxes, because it's so difficult to check them out. The space is very limited and it's really dark in here, so I, I wasn't very inspired to be honest. Old old toys and dolls. I like the boxes. No surprise in here. Oh, that's, there is some sort of old game inside. What are you? He's wearing French football player uniform. There's no price on it. That's a cute piece. <laughs> I quite like him. What about this guy? 23 euros. What are you? I'm not very familiar with toys and figurines. I should learn more. I should definitely learn. 
Oh, there are some old plushies as well. The eye is missing. This one is cute. How much are you? We don't know. There's no price. So I just quickly googled this guy and apparently he is for sale on eBay for more than 200 euros. The price is not indicated so we'll go and ask how much do they want for him. Let's see. We also find this very cute little girl. So she's with the blue sticker and it's six euros. I don't know if I would be able to remove the stain though. She's very cute. What else do we see in here? So this one, you guys. They said it would be 5 euros, I'm screaming right now. I'm taking this one for sure. And I keep looking for some goodies. What do we have in here? I'm sorry, my hands are a bit shaking right now because I'm so excited. So that's... That's cute. A very cute Scotty. What do we use it for? Is that like a a ghost? A tiny tray? Not sure. Oh, here's more. Okay. That would be perfect to put the cup on, right? To use it as a coaster. I don't know how much is it. If the price is between 6 and 23 euros. And the sticker is missing on this one. So because it's a bigger piece, I think they would say 23 euros. Let's leave it. Again, any brooches? Let me check the case. Oh, she's lovely, isn't she? Is that a draw? Oh, sorry. <laughs> you could see on my finger. I was trying to show that drawing of the lady for 18 euros. That's something that I'm interested in. I will ask the lovely lady to show it for me. That's something I like. That's something that I really like. But you guys, how I met this Napoleon. He's 35 euros. I need to check him out as well. I really like him. Mm. Pas évident, n'est-ce pas? Non, pas évident. Bon, c'est pas grave, je vais réfléchir. Ici, on peut juste voir le Napoléon. Ouais, juste un. Oh, je pense que c'est imprimé. Mmh. C'est juste signé sur le, sur le verre, on dirait, c'est ça. Ouais. Mmh. Mmh. Okay, est... Et, et, et il est là. <rire> Tout en fond. Ça c'est au fort. Oui. Mm -hmm. Ah oui, lui il est beau. Oui, 
Lui, je dois apprendre. <rire> Ça, il n'y a pas de choix. <rire> oui, il est bien. Ça va. So obviously, I had to get the Napoleon artwork. The colors are amazing, and for the price, for 35 euros, it's difficult to find one like this because there are many collectors collecting Napoleon pieces. I don't know if I'm one of those, but I think I'm, I'm slowly becoming one. <gasps> but he's... Oh, look! I remember that dog. He's adorable. They have a bunch of them, but that's the one that I like. He's 120 euros, an old piece. So that, that makes sense lovely old lithographs very cute so i think that's a wrap we found quite a few lovely pieces today i will show them afterwards in more detail when we come back to our hotel This is my today's shopping haul. So this is 5 euros and 35 for this amazing old little graph of Napoleon Bonaparte. Awesome. I hope you enjoyed thrifting with me today. Let me know in the comments how you liked this shop. Have you spotted something that I missed? Let me know. I am always very interested in reading your comments. Until then, happy thrifting and thank you. I'll see you soon. Bye.